For cheap and reliable ultimate team coins, go to fifacoin.com. What's up guys, I'm Tomer FC Oven and welcome back to our Road to Glory Carrier Mode series with Nottingham Forest. We are 5th in the table, we suffered 2 losses in our last 3 games in the league. So the season is getting more and more interesting. If you enjoyed this series, make sure to smash the likes and get this video to maybe 150 or 200 likes if you want to see more episodes in this series. And also I will show you a squad report at the end of this episode, let's play Bolton away, we need a win guys to climb up the table. This series is one of my biggest carrier mode challenges yet, so if you want to keep the series going guys, please smash the likes, it really, really it's really important how many likes and views these episodes get, because that's the only way if these episodes uh, get enough support that I can continue this series. Let's try and beat Bolton, come on! Oh, Roberts! Roberts! What a start! This is insane! Roberts smashes it first time into the near post and the goalkeeper can't save it. This is amazing! What a start! A brilliant ball by Antonio and Roberts just smashes it first time and goalkeeper can't save it. Brilliant start! Get in! Patrick Roberts, the new signing with a goal. Keeper! Oh my god, what the fuck was that, mate? Oh shit. Oh, how is he through? What a miss. No! No! Oh, yes, Darlo, well done. Roberts! Roberts! Roberts, what are you doing? Oh, I should have been too near. Patterson, what a save by the keeper! No! No! Oh, what a clearing header! Please! Darlow again, brilliant! Good changes in the midfield because we have a lot of tired players. So Vaughn, Tasha and Burke coming on. Patterson! Come on, Patterson! Smash it! It's two! Finally! Patterson! <laughs> Let's do the... <laughs> that funny celebration! Finally, Patterson puts the game to bed. A great run and a lovely finisher. Brilliant goal by Patterson. He's such a good finisher. Antonio! Oh! He should have scored, really. We are back to winning ways guys, that's a great victory, we managed to smash Bolton 2-0, very very happy with this win. Oh yes, we, we needed this and we finished our chances very well. We are second in the table, only one point behind Middlesbrough and we are playing Derby, Derby, County, Derby County at home with this team and if we can win, we, we might leapfrog Middlesbrough if they drop points. So let's try and win this game, really looking forward to this, we are on a good run, let's go! Nottingham against Derby County, very very big game, huge game in fact in our season, let's get another victory! Russell, come on, score! Penalty! Oh my god, no! Oh, Darlow, well done. No! No, how did, they, how did they get that? That's bull crap. Darlow with the save and I just couldn't clear it. Oh, no. Come on. Penalty. Ref, that's a stone ball penalty. What are you playing at? Are you blind? Cheers, Alan. Come on, score! Go in, please! Yes! Finally! Get the ball! Get in! Finally, we got an equalizer! 
Lansbury, after a brilliant pass by Aston Malonga, it's a very lucky goal because it hits the defender's leg and just bubbles in. But I think it would have gone in anyway. 1-1, we are back in it. Let's try and get the winner, we have 8 minutes left. Come on, boys. The game finishes as a 1-1 draw and to be honest, uh, I'm quite uh, fortunate to get away with the 1-1 draw because we haven't played that well. But Derby, Derby didn't create a lot of chances either, so I think a draw in the end was a fair result. So we have three players who are off to international duty, Russell, Williams and Vaughan. And also Wilson's loan, short loan is expired and to be honest he couldn't really get into the team. And this is how the league table looks like. So at the moment we are third and only one point behind Birmingham, two points behind Cardiff. So the league is going to be a really really tight affair. Our goal difference is brilliant as you can see. But there are five teams on 17 points, so it's it's just such a close, tight league, and uh, the margins will be very, very short. And now I will show you the squad report for the first time, uh, I think in a long, long time. And I'm pretty happy with Darlow, he kept five clean sheets in 11 games, that's pretty awesome. And also Hewitt is improving very nicely, Mancian and Wilson, two very good centre-backs. And Jack Hunt, another player who is very promising. So I think uh, I think with this squad we can get promoted. Johnny Russell, he has been a great signing for 2 million plus Dev Vries. And also Henry Lansbury has big potential, so I have high hopes for him. And basically most of our players are very young. Burke is 30 years old, but he can still do a job for us. And the good news is that uh, many of our players are sharing the goals around. Antonio is, has been... One of our my our best players. He has been out injured for a uh, quite a long time, but he still got four goals. Same with Patterson and Aston Balonga. So as you can see, a lot of the players are sharing the goals around. And our strike forward is very young, so they can play for many many years at this club. And uh, and yeah, I signed this goalkeeper Callum Burton because he. He, he cost me like peanuts and I think he will be a great goalkeeper in the long run. And also Patrick Roberts, he's on loan and he will be a very good player for us as well. I will si try and sign him up on a permanent deal. Tesha, another player who is improving all the time. Uh, Vaughn, uh, even though he's 31 years old, his, his stats are going up. Uh, so, um, so yeah, I'm very, very happy with how, how this team is playing. And uh, Lastel, who is a loan player... That's why I'm not playing him that much. Also, Williams, um, he can't really get a lot of playing time. But uh, the, it's important that we have a big squad, guys, because uh, because uh, you know some of the players go on international duty, and then we will be short. And uh, if there are some injuries, then we will be um, needing the big squad. And I wonder if I can get promoted this season. And also one of the other things that I'm very happy and excited about is that we have some really big talents in our youth academy. Mainly this guy, he could be our future first choice goalkeeper. He's already minimum 56 rated, but I will, I will wait until the May update. And if we get promoted, I think, uh, you know, Darlo is on loan and I think I won't sign a new goalkeeper, but I will make this guy our first choice goalkeeper next season and uh, what a what an amazing thing that would be for a 17 year old to play in the Premier League and I think his, his overall will go up with the May update and his potential looks like he could be our first choice goalkeeper for many many years and he wouldn't cost me anything because he's a youth academy player so very very happy with that and he's Scottish so guys make sure to smash the likes if you enjoy this series and want to see more episodes the more likes these episodes get, the more I will upload in this series. Have a nice day, hope you enjoyed this. See you later, guys. Goodbye! Games, though, don't come much bigger than this one, guys. The fiercest of rivals. This is the biggest game in English football between two of the most successful and biggest clubs with the most fans.